Welcome! Today we look at the critical concept that can significantly impact your backtesting results, survivorship bias. What is survivorship bias? Survivorship bias refers to the tendency to focus solely on the strategies or indicators that have survived historical testing, neglecting those that failed. This creates a skewed perception of performance, potentially leading to overconfidence in seemingly successful strategies. We do the same mistake when we dream of becoming a millionaire trader or rock star. We look at the winners, and we forget the millions who try but fail. Think about this. Research shows that the majority of stocks perform poorly over their lifetime. Most of the gains in the stock market come from the few outliers, and we only know those in hindsight. Why is it important to understand survivorship bias? Backtesting is a cornerstone of trading, allowing us to evaluate the effectiveness of trading strategies on historical data. However, survivorship bias can mislead us. Consider a scenario where you backtest numerous trading indicators. The test identifies a few indicators with impressive results, but these results might not be a true reflection of their overall effectiveness. The backtest might have overlooked numerous failed indicators in stocks, presenting an incomplete picture. You only know those who fail in hindsight. How do you mitigate survivorship bias? Here are practical steps to mitigate survivorship bias in your backtesting. Test a comprehensive range of indicators. Don't cherry-pick indicators or settings based on preconceived notions. Include a diverse set in your backtesting process. Run an optimization of the settings. Make sure you include delisted stocks. Factor in transaction costs. Backtests often neglect transaction costs like commission and spreads. Incorporate these costs to get a more realistic picture of strategy performance. Consider alternative data sets. Don't limit yourself to a single historical period. Test across various market conditions to assess the strategy's adaptability. Consider trading indexes. They're less likely to be a victim of survivorship bias. By acknowledging survivorship bias, you can conduct more robust backtests, leading to better results in your trading. Remember, backtesting is a valuable tool, but it should be used cautiously while considering potential biases. If you'd like to know more about backtesting, please check out the link to our backtesting course under the article, and don't forget to like and subscribe so we can provide more videos like this.